I am a stomp fellow. We go to a classroom once a week to play with Legos and teach kids science. Is everyone sitting? This semester we have 50 stomp fellows, which means we are in 25 classrooms. Who can tell me what the challenge is for this week? Our final project was that the kids had to build an amusement park. Right now I want you guys to split into your partners. Their only rules were, were that it had to have a motor. And whose ride is this? We figured an amusement park, park ride could um, yeah. incorporate civil engineering, mechanical engineering, and electrical engineering. Oh. Yeah. The civil for sturdiness, um, mechanical for the moving parts, and the electrical for the program. Sure, sure. sure. Right. Yeah. 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 It doesn't necessarily have to be, hey, it's engineering time, or hey, it's science time. It could be anything using the engineering, using the Legos, whatever the particular medium they're using to teach some sort of subject. And it just happens that they, uh, as a consequence, are learning about engineering. Whoa! Whoa! What does it do? Do 15 minutes, everyone. Ow! Take cover! Everybody duck now wait. Hit run. Watch how you get Do you think it will hit me? No. Let's go. Look at the chains. So what is your ride called? The tea time of terror. Because it, it originally was supposed to be a slow, peaceful, like a teacup ride, and then it just turned into this whole like really scary whirling thing. So it's really fast. And, and. Put a flag I have a friend who's a teacher. She is telling me that the students who usually struggle in her class mm -hmm. actually are the ones who are doing the best when this mm -hmm. comes in the classroom. Makes sense, right? Because it's a different type of learning. All of a sudden, you've got this crazy chaos going on, and these students are thriving. Yeah, it's going to hold up a long time.